Andrew Cross. This is BRFM, and this is a Fund for Joe dance music special. And I'm joined by one of the finest DJs ever to have walked this fine planet, Jonathan Jones. Hello, Johnny. How are you doing? Okay. Yeah, very well. Excellent. Nice to see you again, bud. Yeah, good to be back. Good to be back. I'm um, really honoured that you came back, mate. Thank you. Third, third or fourth time, I believe, now. So we can try and make it a, a regular affair, as we say. So yeah, well, you know, come along whenever you like, okay. really. Well, to say that, not every week. No, do I, you know I, mean? I don't I do that. No, I think it's a bit far for me to come every <laughs> week, but yeah. <laughs> it'll, be a, it'll be a late night every Tuesday, otherwise, wouldn't it? But yeah, uh, exactly. But tonight... We're here for a special reason, yeah? Uh, as I said, this is a Fund for Joe uh, dance music special. Uh, Joe is Joe Hendy. And hopefully, I'll be speaking to Joe now on the phone. Hello, Joe. Hi. Hey, yeah. How All are right. you? How are you? I'm not too bad, thank you. Cool. Thanks for joining uh, me on air. No, it's, it's a pleasure. It's nice to be asked. <laughs> first time on radio, Joe? It is, yes. Yes, first time. Okay, maybe not the last, you never know. Well, hopefully not, no. <laughs> so, the first question is, how are you feeling today? Not too bad today. had a pretty good day today, yeah. Um, yeah, I've been really busy, so uh, take my mind off other things. But yeah, on the whole, pretty good today. Cool. And obviously, uh, the fun for Joe, the Facebook page now has over 4,290 likes. I know, wow. That's amazing, isn't it? Yeah. That is absolutely amazing. Uh, I remember when it was set up on the Friday. That's right. And it, it was about 3,000 likes within two days, wasn't it? So, it, it? It did. It was just... I was oblivious to all this, to be honest, <laughs> um, until it was all set up and running. Cool. Um, yeah, it all started from a phone call in... Uh, a phone call, sorry. Uh, a te- uh, conversation in Tesco's with a friend of mine, Angela. Yeah. And... She um, put it out on Facebook, and people were liking and sharing. And then, um, school friend Sally Mark and and Joe Goff, they got hold of it, and they'd set up a page. And this is still all before I'm unaware of any of this <laughs> until there's like sort of three thousand likes, and and my phone starts going berserk, and 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 my my iPad is beeping uncontrollably, and I'm thinking, what's going on? Yeah. And then and then seeing everything, yeah. That's cool, man. Yeah. <laughs> so, um, the target for uh, your treatment, yeah? Yeah. Is uh, 20 grand. So, do you know how much has been raised so far? Um, I've banked so far £12,447.84. Oh, wow. That is absolutely amazing. It is. Absolutely it's amazing. Yeah. Um, yeah. Well, I went there today and got a balance in it and I put money in today and I was just overwhelmed. I couldn't believe how much was in there in such a short space of time. It's, it's, it's unbelievable. That's great, isn't it? That is it super. really, really is. Good stuff. And obviously we've got more events coming, which I'm going to be announcing uh, after Johnny's first mix. Yeah. And we'll just for all the events. And this is before, you know, the majority of the events start. So hopefully we will uh, yeah. hit that target, do you know what I mean? Yeah. And, and hopefully it'll, it'll raise more because yeah. not only do I need the £20,000 now, um, my oncologist has said that I'll need this treatment for the rest of my life, so it needs to sort of be more. Yeah. Well. So I think we're not only going to meet it, we're going to smash it. it as well. We're going to smash it, and we're yeah, going to we we're going to make as much as possible. Yeah. Okay. Thank you for joining me. Thanks for uh, introducing the show, really, or giving us the background of yourself. Do you know what I mean? Well, thank you for having me. Oh, it's an absolute pleasure, and we'll uh, you know read out the Facebook page and. Uh, the link to the donation page throughout the show, do you know what I mean? Thank you, and thank you for your support. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely no problem at all. So, uh, thank you for joining me, Joe. Oh, thank you. No worries. Right then, Johnny. Uh, nice to hear from Joe, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it's fantastic, fantastic. We're going to smash that target. We're going to absolutely we will, smash we will. it. We will, treble it, treble it. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do now is listen to one of your mixes. So this is, was it Classic House? Yeah, more or? of a Classic House. Yeah, I sort of played, the last one I played more sort of a newer house. This is more of a classic for uh, a lot of our listeners. We've got a few, uh, few people listening already. So I think a lot of the guys I know listening will know a lot of these tracks, probably take them back a fair bit. So enjoy. Thank you. 
By Johnny Jones <laughs> with a nice sharp finish there. Do you know what I mean? No, no, no. It just went then to one zero zero. So. Well, might not be your fault. Might be. No. Try, try speaking now. Probably not. <laughs> I think it was your fault. Anyway, <laughs> where there's a blame, there's a claim. Exactly, exactly. Well, a few classics anyway. I think is enough to get the the listeners ready. It's enough to get the blood pumping around That's the it, veins, just, isn't it? Just to start off, you know, just to start it off. Yeah, cool, yeah. man, cool. So, uh, <coughs> obviously, we had a bit of Tori Amos there. Yeah. Professional Widow, is that the name of the Correct, track? Correct, yeah. Uh, remixed by Armin van Helden. Yeah, yeah. That was uh, completely different to the original. I think all he oh, did, yeah. he stripped down the bass and yeah. uh, just kept looping it. So, I think it turned out amazingly well, because, uh, you know. It got know. number one, didn't it? it number was, one, yeah. Sold, uh, sold a lot of lemon. Number uh, one. Records and uh, whatever tunes was do we hear? Um, so the first one, Get the Call Passion, which is from about 94 95, that was a, a classic. I was telling you earlier that was then about five six years later, they put sort of a vocal over it, like a mashup, and it ruined the track. But that actually got, I think, in the top 10. But that one there was a bit more underground, so uh, yeah, I was Get the Call. And then we heard a bit of Leona Lewis, Bleeding Love, a, a remix that I came across a couple of months ago, so it was fantastic. I love Leona so, Lewis's voice, she's got a fabulous, she has, voice, yeah. she has amazing. Easy. Okay, so let's uh, remind everybody why we're here. Um, <coughs> this is a fun for Joe dance music special. Uh, Joe Hendy, who we spoke to earlier, uh, the NHS uh, refused the cancer treatment for her. So uh, a fund has been set up by her friends and family, etc., to try and raise the necessary money. Uh, basically, the Facebook page, which has uh, got loads of likes now, is uh, Fund for Joe. If you search Fund for Joe in Facebook, it'll come up. And also the donation page with the uh, actual story of the cause, www.pinkwalks.co.uk forward slash Joe's Fund dot HTML. Okay, we're going to play uh, a track now that I've chosen, Johnny. Right? Okay. okay. I do like the odd, you know, dance track. Yeah, I know, you know I, I mean? know, no, I know, I know. So, uh, is this going to impress me? Is this one? Well, this is what we're going to find well, out. There we see. go. I want there your professional judgment no at the end of the track.
Blood Orange, that was Jamaica. Johnny Jones. What do you think, Bat? Fantastic. Uh, like that, too? I've never heard of them before. Blood Orange, I will be checking those out. Yeah, I like the sax in it. Yeah, fantastic. fantastic. It's got like a bit of a 70s disco yeah, feel, yeah. isn't it? Yeah, and more like a sort of a, an Ibiza sort of, uh, you know, um, Café Del Mar theme. Yeah. Excellent. Yeah, that's, excellent. yeah, that's a good description, mate. Yeah, thank you. The album, yeah, is called uh, <coughs> Cupid Deluxe, yeah. And it's got, you know, all that type of style and a couple of rap tracks yeah, as well. So well, when is that from? What? Uh, it's from last year, I think. Yeah, it was released great, last year. Check them out. Definitely. Excellent. Yeah, 2013. Domino Excellent. Records. Superb, superb Brilliant. album. Okay. Um, <coughs> we've got some events lined up for Fun for Joe, yeah? So okay. I'm going to go through them. In uh, April, yeah? Live band night. Uh, risky business at the Riverside Club in Cum. Uh, and then on the 5th of April as well, uh, sorry, the 5th of April, Head Shave by Terry Price at the Luca di Roma. I don't know where that is, I must admit. Have you heard of that? Luca di Roma? Italy? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we get it everywhere. We get into Italy. A 50 mile bike ride as well by Derek Dobbs and Karen Dobbs. That's impressive, That's isn't going, it? Yeah, 50 mile, yeah, definitely. Yeah, I couldn't do 50 meters nowadays, could I? Well. I could. <laughs> <laughs> Charity Night at Garn Lidden at the Garn Lidden Club on the 6th of April. 80s and 90s disco, the last more us, and then, huh? At the Legion Club. So let's yeah. get down there. Let's, let's get down there. Let's Perhaps we'll do another a guest mix, maybe. You never, you yeah, never know. You never know. They might ask you on, but. There you go. That's the 12th of April. Also on the 12th of April, the Ebervale Male Voice Choir are singing at the Choir Hall Christchurch in Ebervale. Fantastic. And they are excellent. I've heard them before. Uh, a play on at Dizzy Kids Shadiga. That's on the 13th of April. Uh, on the 14th of April, uh, Baguette Shop JJ Income. JJ. JJ. Yeah, 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 how cool is that? That's a cream tea day on okay. honour of Fun for Joe. Uh, Salvation Army Cakes Doll at the Salvation Hall Aubrey Terrace. I think that's income. That's on the 19th. 
uh, on the 20th, a charity evening singer magician at the Ambala Indian Restaurant. And let me just tell you this now. The food there is absolutely superb. Is that next to the, the shop there? Is that no, yeah. it's uh, the old Park Hotel. Oh, right, yeah. It's, yeah, it's I, now in India. Yeah, oh, nice. it, yeah oh. it looks nice, it looks nice. Suit you, sir, right, do yeah. you know what I mean? And then also on in April the 25th or the 4th, charity night for Joe's Fund at the Badminton Club in Ebervale. So quite a lot coming up. Yeah, definitely. So it's great stuff. Yeah. Thanks to everybody who's getting involved. Yeah, so thank you very much. Then. Keep it up, keep it up. Can't fault it. Okay, next, what are we having? We're having a Johnny Jones choice of track. So what's coming up? Or are you going to tease me, bud? I'm going to tease you. I'm going to tease you. <laughs> okay. I think you'll know it, though. Do you reckon? Yeah. All right, let's shove it on. <laughs> Thank you. 
Okay, what a superb track there. What was that one called then, Johnny Boy? <laughs> <laughs> Hold the Sucker Down by OT Quartet. It went a bit blank then, yes. That's, uh, that was a big track back in the day that I used to get the dance floor pumping. That was a, a floor filler, that was definitely. definitely. Pumping, was it that pumping? Was, but there's a, uh, something you probably didn't know. Yeah. Um, a little, little bit of fact for you. That was by Rolo, who was Faithless. Who was, ah. uh, yeah, so he was behind Faithless. I love that. I think he was um, uh, Sister Bliss's husband, I think, at one stage. So. Yeah, I yeah. think you're right, mate. I do I think do. you're right. So. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're going to uh, talk now about more about Fun for Joe, yeah? On YouTube at the moment, Johnny, right? There's a video which is uh, I Do Anything for Joe. Okay. And basically, it's, uh, you know, I do anything Joe says it all. Basically, you do, you know, some dare or whatever okay, or yeah. Yeah. something silly for Joe. Uh, so, a lady called Jessie has done a video, yeah? And to date, there's been something like over uh, 1,700 views of right. this video. Right. So, yes. that's great. And it obviously Fantastic, spreading yeah. the word. Definitely. And getting it out there. Uh, and I'm being joined now on the line by Jessie. Hello, Jessie. Hello. How are you? I'm very well, thank you. Cool. Where are you calling? Uh, where am I calling you to now at the moment? Where are you from? Where are you at the moment? I'm in Worcester. Ah, right, cool. So yeah. uh, just over the border from here in Wales. Yes, not too far away. Cool. So how did you hear about uh, Fun for Joe? Um, a friend contacted me and just asked me if I'd be interested in making a short vid to raise awareness um, for the cause, and I thought, well, why not? Brilliant. Okay. And if I can help, I will. Right. Excellent. <laughs> Excellent. So how easy was it to uh, make the video? For me, it was very easy because I'm used to making videos. So it was um, just water off the duck's back, really. Ah, uh, cool. Um, <coughs> right. I see you're on uh, Twitter as well. At, yes, that's uh, right. At Miss Messy Jessie is your username, yeah? That's right, yeah. Cool. So, how long have you been on Twitter? Are you a Twitter addict? Um, I've been on Twitter for a couple of years, but I've only recently got to grips with it. So, now I use it quite a lot, yes. Cool. And uh, the video I Do Anything for Joe so far has got over like 1,700 views, which is excellent. So. Yeah, that's really good news. That's good. And I hope that uh, some funds have been raised from it. So, that's and good. Cool. So, and you also have a website, uh, www.messy, is that a forward slash jessie.com, yeah? Messy hyphen jessie.com. Cool. Yeah. So, what's that site about? It's, um, it's a fetish site where basically I get messy a uh, lot. <laughs> cool. Is it just yeah. you or is it other people? No, there's me and my friends. I have lots of friends. Who, who enjoy taking part as well. So we just get together and have food fights. <laughs> <laughs> How cool is that? That's the way to spend uh, spend your time in it, do you know what I mean? So, yeah, excellent. absolutely. Well, the, way I, the way I see it is, if I get a little bit stressed, a good pie to the face relaxes me and makes everything better. <laughs> <laughs> what more can you say? What more can you say? So obviously the the actual video is you in a bath tipping custard over yourself or something. Is that right? Yes, that's correct. That's so something a little bit silly. Um, it's always good. Why not? Anyone can do it. Yeah, exactly. We're hoping that uh, other people will, you know, do something similar on video. I've had a few people say to me, "Yeah, I'm going to do that." So uh, yeah, that would be great if they did. It'd be really, really good. Yeah, hopefully it'll start a bit of a trend and we can get. Uh, the name out there, do you know what I mean? Fun for yeah. Joe. Uh, a friend, uh, a friend messaged me today to say that he had seen the video and made a donation to the fund. So that's one contribution so far. <laughs> brilliant, brilliant. That's what that's what we want, isn't it? So uh, yeah, exactly. Yeah. The target is twenty thousand, and uh, so far it's on twelve thousand. Do you know what I mean? So hopefully, that's brilliant. Exactly. So hopefully that video has gone some way to, uh, you know, helping raise the money. So fingers crossed. So, like, you know, thank you very much. Uh, we do appreciate your contribution to the cause, yeah? You're welcome. And, uh, you know, good luck with everything in the future, and thank you very much for joining me. No worries. Thank you very much for having me on. No problem. I'll uh, speak to you again. Okay, thank you. Take care. Okay, bye. Bye. 
What a lovely woman she was, wasn't yeah. she? Yeah. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. Uh, very nice accent. Love yes. the accent. Yes. So, uh, yeah. So, go to YouTube. Search for "I Do Anything for Joe" on YouTube. Make your own video if you like, and uh, you know, post it on YouTube, and let's get let's get the word out there. Come on, Jay Dyer. Let's have a video of you. <laughs> Jay Dyer. As he's listening in. Super Jay Dyer. Right. Okay. So next track time. Johnny's picked another track. Yeah. So uh, let's let's go for it. Okay, <laughs> another sharp finish to another great uh, <laughs> track. Yes, it was. Yes, it was. It was a lovely sharp finish. So, talk about that track while I try and find something else to put on, mate. Yeah. So that was M and S presents the girl next door. Um, a nice deep funky house track there for uh, for the listeners. <laughs> cool, man. Cool. Okay. <clears throat> right, okay, we're going to put on another song. Right, this one's chosen by myself, right, okay? So this one's not going to cut off because it's from an album, right? <laughs> this is sort of like dubstep. Okay, yeah. Do you know okay. that you're familiar with the 
the genre. Yeah, I know dubstep well. Yeah, yeah so uh, it's quite a chill out song, to be fair, but uh, it is, well, in my opinion, an opinion, you know, opinions, opinions. Yeah, yeah. I shall tell you once it's been played. This one is quite beautiful. So I'm going to play this track now. This is uh, The Weight of Gold. <laughs> Forest Swords there with the weight of gold. What do you think of that one, Bat? Very nice, very good. Cool. 
I like that type of genre. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, it sort of good. chills you as Ch- well. Chill out. I won't say dubstep though, but it's uh, yeah. it's good, good stuff. It's like John Hopkins. Have you got that album? Yeah, John Hopkins. Yeah, yeah. good album. That good type album. of stuff. I'm really. Yeah, he, do with. you know he's just uh, produced a new Coldplay album? So I'm expecting I a few. Yep. Yeah, so I'm oh, expecting wow. that to be better than the last one. So hopefully. well, let's not talk negative. But no. the last one wasn't as good, say, as the pre- no, no, <laughs> the previous no. ones. But yeah, yeah, it'd be interesting, yeah, wouldn't yeah, it? Yeah, yeah, definitely. So, yeah, produced it all. Excellent stuff. Right, okay, what have we got coming up next then, Johnny? So a little bit different for you now. I've gone for a bit of a drum and bass mix. Uh, so <laughs> Get in there. Yeah, it's, a not, it's not heavy drum and bass. It's quite soulful, um, but I hope we enjoy it. It's uh, pretty good, I hope. Let's go.
cracking mix there. Bit of drum and bass. Drum and bass, a little bit different there. They used to be called jungle, didn't it? Well, it's just called... Uh, drum and bass is a bit more heavy on the drums, whereas yeah. jungle were a bit more... No, jungly drum, I suppose. So that's a bit more breakbeat drum on drum and bass. <laughs> a bit more jungly drum. I love <laughs> yeah, well, that. I like a bit more yeah. jungly drum. Jungly drums. You've heard it from Johnny Jones. Thank you very much. Jungle yeah. is a bit more. <laughs> jungly <laughs> drum. <laughs> oh no, Andrew, pull yourself together. <laughs> that's class. That's got to be quote of the day, but that's got to be. Thank quote. you, thank you. Always entertaining, Johnny. You've got, I've yeah. got to give you that, but thank you. And to be fair, really enjoyed the mix. So, <coughs> what kind of a, what artists were on the mix? Um, that, that sort of self, soulful <coughs> drummer mix. You had um, a Ronnie size track on there. Oh, from, Ronnie from size, yeah. a Ronnie size track. Um, mostly Bristol and London producers. Uh, mm. London Electricity was another track. They're a great band. Great band. <laughs> what are they called? London Electricity. Correct. <laughs> Great name for a band. Jungle drums, you know. I like it. <laughs> right, okay. <clears throat> right, let's remind everybody why we're here. Maybe I'll stop laughing like a okay. hyena then, do you know what I mean? Okay. <clears throat> I don't think I've ever snorted on air before, do you know what I mean? But I've snorted yeah. tonight. Well done. Not that type of snorting. No, and no, I can no, see no. your face no. now, do you know what I mean? <laughs> right. <clears throat> yes, our good friend Joe Hendy, yeah. Uh, she's trying to raise money t for uh, to get some cancer treatment, basically, because the NHS refused the funds. So, uh, www.facebook.com forward slash fund for Joe. Go and like that page if you already haven't. <coughs> Excuse me. www.pinkwalks.co.uk forward slash Joe's fund dot HTML. That's the donation page and the explanation of the fund. Okay, right. What's the next track going to be, Johnny? Johnny's chosen this one as well. Yeah, so this is a, a special track. Any household out there would know there's a few listening. Uh, Frankie Knuckles, a uh, big hero of mine. Um, he died yesterday, uh, age of 59. He was the person that invented house. He actually, um, it was him that invented it with some other guys.
Great track there, Johnny. Good choice, man. And who was Thank that you. again? That's Frankie Nichols. Rest in peace. Ah. And seriously, he did die, yeah? Well, seriously, he yeah, died, yeah. yeah. And he's a, he's a, anybody in the house, he's a hero. Over Facebook, over Twitter, it's just absolutely jammed today. Uh, really sad news, really sad news. Yeah. He was yeah. the pioneer.